Hey guys, what's up? It's Wes bringing you more Battlefield Heroes gameplay today. Um, as long as you guys keep watching these, I'll keep posting them. So if you guys want to see Battlefield Heroes, I'll post Battlefield Heroes. It's whatever you guys want because I'm doing it for you. <laughs> so uh, yeah, just say whatever you want to see in the comments. I can do whatever. I have, I have two of every class, so just put comments of what you want to see in the next video. I'll do it. So today I'm on my uh, Royal Soldier, his name's Captain Falcon, and I'm at Seaside Skirmish, if you didn't already notice, if, or if you've just started playing the game. Um, if you've just started playing the game, it's an awesome game and play it. Uh, and if not, then that's awesome too, because this is an awesome game. Okay, so um, I start out by flying over to Hillside Farm, I believe, and uh, I see this Jeep over here, so I'm like, I'm not gonna stand for that. So I blow him up, and then I wing clip the second guy. And my, I have weird connection. Okay, right here, it's gonna glitch out. And I had, it's, it's just hard to recover from that. See, like all of a sudden I'm sideways across the ocean. So it's like, yeah. And I think it's funny because right here when I was playing, I didn't, yeah, okay. I didn't notice, but <laughs> I totally just killed my teammate right there. I ditched my plane and the plane destroyed his tank. And I just realized that as I was putting this video together. And right here, I'm like, oh crap, there's three guys. So I blasting strike them, get the heck out of there. So I heal, and then another guy pops out, and he tries to get me, and then I get a critical, and I get two 27s in a row, so that was very, very lucky. And then another guy finds me, <laughs> this guy's funny, you'll see what he does later in the battle. But, um, yeah, so I get rid of him, and then I go back over to check, and I see that guy, so I, I won't stand for that either, so I'm like, hey, look at that, a perfectly innocent German, I might as well execute him. And then there's this guy right here too, get him, blasting strike him into the ceiling, split his head open, no biggie. Um, then I walk over into a village and my connection glitches out again right here So it's it's very odd you have to learn to deal with these things which I've done over time, but um Yes, so I contemplate getting in that Jeep, but I see that it's on on fire So I'm like, okay, no, I don't think I'm gonna do that. So I go over here and I think I wander for a little while But like right when I turn the corner I run into a, a national I'm, I'm pretty sure yeah, he pops out in between those buildings right there and I'm looking around for him, and I'm like, what the heck, where is he? And then I find him. So me and this guy also have some pretty good battles throughout the battle. <laughs> and um, he pops back later and almost destroys me. This part, I was kind of mad because I got him to really low health, and then <laughs> my teammate pops out in the tank and destroys him. But if that was the teammate that I killed earlier, then I think I can forgive him. I hope it was, because then I won't feel like as big of a jerk, but... You know, whatever. Um, so I start feeling bold here, and for some reason I started chasing after this tank, and I thought that shooting my pistol at him might do something, even though I know, knew good and well that it wouldn't do anything. So I thought he was going to tip there, but I figured that my teammate was going to win, so I just waited until he popped out of his tank to, to attack him. So I'm just crouching behind this tree for cover, and he pops out and I start shooting at him, as you can plainly see. And uh, this map or this match was just a lot of fun today because I don't know it just it was one of those ones where everything just kind of clicks like it's just fun you know when you get in maps or matches that you do good but they're not always really fun you, well yeah you, you know that feel <laughs> I know that feel bro um, but <laughs> there's the guy again he's funny because yeah he's gonna say something after this battle I'm pretty sure. Um, which I didn't see for a couple seconds. Yeah, it's, it's that guy. He starts calling me a hacker, and it's pretty funny. Because um, he, like, swears on his life that I'm a hacker. But it's pretty funny. Um, it's nice to hear that, too. Yeah, see, look right there, Captain Aimbot. But it's always a nice, reassuring thought to be called an Aimbot. Because it makes you feel like you're on the edge of your game. Or not on the edge of your game, on your game. But um, that guy, he's the guy that that battle's pretty close with. If, as you saw, um, we both blasting strike at the same time, so that was interesting. Um, I can't remember if I went back and got him or not, but yeah, I don't know. Right here, I finally noticed that he, <laughs> he called me an aimbot. But um, I go back over here, and it's really weird. When I start walking towards Hill, yeah, actually, it's starting now. It was like glitching a lot. Like, it's just starting to freeze. As soon as I take out the Rudolph's Uber Rescue, it just starts going weird. <laughs> like, I don't know what happened. But, um,. Yeah, so I switch back to the pistol, start firing at this guy. Um, always a recommendation, even if you're using the short fast and the guy's far away, 
switch or if you're using the long slow pistol or smg just use that until it runs out of ammo but switch to your other weapon no matter what distance it is when you run out of ammo because any any shots fired at them is better than nothing so i missed that guy but yeah any shots fired at them is better than nothing even if even if they're close up and you're using the long one it's it's damaged so you know um but i go back and i check over here there's nobody here so i start to wander over to hillside farm um <laughs> the guy's gonna call me a hacker again in a little bit it's funny but um yeah, I thought that guy was a bad guy, but he wasn't. Um, so yeah, I just start firing at these guys. Paint gets in the way. I dealt with it. <laughs> but um, yeah, see, look, perfect example right there. Reloading, that switch back over to it works just as well. As long as you're getting damage in, that's all that matters, really. Um, but yeah, this guy is weird. He got killed in midair. I can't tell if that was a tank smash or if the other guy killed him, but um, I think almost every blasting strike I use on a tank in this battle I miss because I'm used to on my national soldier it has he has five out of five blasting strike so I'm so used to the range being a lot bigger that <laughs> I misjudged like all these like this tank right here I totally miss it too I thought I had blasting strike charge but I don't and then he goes nowhere again <laughs> see there he's calling me an idiot hacker again if he sees this he'll laugh but um yeah this battle had a very interesting ending. I can't say that this has ever happened to me before, but I like this part too, kind of weaving in and out of the trees. I've never done that in the battle, so I thought that was pretty fun. But um, this battle, if you try to say that I'm noob bashing, it's because I'm level 10 and I'm barely level 10. That's why most of them don't have ranks. Um, also, yeah, he has like a 3.0 ratio, so that's why there's guys without, or there, that's why there's guys with ranks. Um, but yeah, over here it's interesting. I'm firing at this guy, and more guys pop. Yeah, there's the connection gl glitch again. But I'm firing at him, and then more guys pop out. So I start to retreat, and <laughs> I forgot that there was a cliff behind me. <laughs> so yeah, fell down there, and yeah. So I'm just like, uh, what am I gonna do? Uh, there's only four tickets, three tickets left anyway. So I might as well just conclude. So I was just like, eh. I might as well just leave. So, um, thanks guys for watching today. Uh, suggest which one of my characters you think I should use for my next match, and I'll do that. And thank you for watching. Goodbye.